Welcome back to a diva on a budget welcome to my channel if you're new what's up my name is monique i'm the diva and if you're a returning guest welcome back diva squad thank you so much for supporting your girl happy saint patty's day y'all today i'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial we're gonna be featuring this violet boss i love you forever palette and the colors in this palette say yes it's St. Patty's Day. I love you too. So we're going to go ahead and get into this palette. And we're going to get into some new drugstore products that I got too. So let's go ahead and get into it. By the way, you guys like my cookie shirt? We got the greens. Don't pinch me. I'm Irish. <laughs> um, Yeah, I'm loving cookies. Sweet tooth. For that. <laughs> so um i got this new milani green goddess uh cannabis sativa seed oil in glow oil it's called a glow oil it's a lightweight oil 100 percent plant-based and it calms and nourishes the skin and it looks alike take it out of the packaging and it looks like this It is so pretty. The packaging is everything. I love the colors. And when I'm done using this up, I'm going to keep this little bottle just because it is cute. I mean, if you know, you know, you guys. <laughs> it's just gorgeous. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with this. And it has a little dropper that you push the button see and it's green actually so i'm gonna put a few drops on my head on my cheek and i really don't do oil my lip right here but i kind of looked up on this and looked up about the oil um usually around the springtime and um late winter spring and summer i get like really dry skin in my t-zone and oh my gosh this feels amazing if you guys um see me looking here it's because my mirrors are here i have a mirror here and a mirror here so bear with me bear bear with me so trying to um i have stuff everywhere because um I'm still in transitioning of trying to rearrange my room um, and me and my husband are trying to figure out what kind of vibe and what kind of feel we want for, um, for this new season. I like to move stuff around. you guys feels good feels good i highly recommend i will let you guys know about this oil how it wears throughout the day it is kind of later in the day um i started my day a little late today and you know sometimes your face have to breathe sometimes you don't have to wear makeup every single day so um i'm also gonna go in with my pharmacy cheer up brightening vitamin c eye cream and it looks like this and everything 
I use, I'll link it down in the description bar below so you guys can see and get anything that I'm using for my face. Also want to throw out there that Serena Silks came out with honey lip gloss too and I'm gonna go ahead and throw this honey lip gloss on my lips it's very nourishing and it's very hydrating so I highly recommend go checking out Serena Silks so I'm gonna throw this on my lips and look at that cute little honey pot like too cute too cute and look at how it looks you guys look at this Oh my gosh, isn't that too cute? So I'm gonna just throw a little bit on my lip. And it has a little honey taste to it too, so it tastes really good. I also have another new product that I've been hearing raves about, but I'm not sure which one will do my skin good. I've heard about the e.l.f. Putty Primer, but I did go and get the e.l.f. Putty Primer Trio, and it does have the Poreless Putty Primer, the Matte Putty Primer, and the Luminous Putty Primer in it, and they're all trial-sized little primers, so I'm going to try all of them and see which one is good for my skin. So today we'll do the Poreless Putty Primer. It says that they are all about four grams each. Four grams of product each. So very cute, small, good trial size. You can use them more than once. And this is how they all look. So I'm excited about these. I also got a few new brushes from the drugstore also from Wet n Wild. I didn't need any more brushes, but of course I did in my mind, so. I got the flat top brush, Wet n Wild, the bent liner brush, and they're all cute, all white and pink, and also the contour brush. Took a brief break for a moment my daughter's folding clothes and she brought me this coke zero loving her mama so happy i drank the rest of that chai tea anyway so i'm about to start drinking here soon y'all what do y'all think of my messy bun it's great looking but the curls is popping right so i'm gonna go ahead and start on the eyebrows because i can so like I said before, if you see me looking here or here, there's a mirror here, so don't don't get upset if I'm not looking at you guys the whole time, okay? I'm talking to you. Sorry. I forgot to let you guys know that I'm going to be using the Jewel Brow Down To Me Brow Duo and it is in the color Chocolate Brown and it's a duo brow gel slash brow pencil. I love this stuff. This is one of my staples in my makeup bag. Go comp you some. I just have to say that blurred a lot of my big pores on my face like do you guys see that wow okay elf okay elf loving I'm gonna go ahead and prime with the elf 16 hour camo concealer and it's always in the color medium sand for my skin tone maybe it'll get a little different in the summertime. I always prime my eyes with concealer. I 
don't get an eye primer. If I do, it's something that I got in a beauty box. So, yeah, that's how life goes with Monique, aka Adiba, aka Momo, aka some Ofra to set that banana powder to set the uh, eye base with a fluffy brush <laughs> I can't sing y'all I just love music um, I have an older brother and actually all my brothers are fine as heck and um, all my brothers are musical in some kind of way and uh, my whole family loves music, so uh, I just, uh, I got it in my blood, and by injection, ha ha, just play, but not really, <laughs> let's just get on into this Kalita. oh my gosh, I will have some swatches while I'm doing my makeup, probably like over here, so you guys can see like the total payoff of the whole palette but right now I'm only gonna be using a few of these colors in this palette because I can't use them all in one time <clears throat> so I am going to use endless desire as a transition and that's this one here and yes y'all I did do these nails myself manicure by Momo so yes endless desires we're going in with that to use that as a transitioning color you with the dark part right here packing it right here with a fluffy brush so that it's just focused on the outside of the eye focusing right here doing circular motions and just like a, a C kind of same and that's all I'm doing to both eyes okay moving on to the next color is going to be olive glow this color here and i'm just gonna pack that all over the lid you guys and it's such a pretty color so what i think i'm going to do is i'm going to get kind of like a flat brush like this and i'm going to use some of my rose water mist i know it looks kind of funny but it's all natural rose water so it took on the roses that are in the bottle and took on some of that color but I'm gonna go ahead and spray my brush with it and dip it into the olive glow color so well y'all Putty primer on and 
ones. I already moisturized myself. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with the BB cream and then throw my lashes on and then put a little bit of brown underneath here. You'll see the color when I do it. Okay. <laughs> Brushed up creamy concealer. I love this stuff. I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna use the e.l.f. Camo Concealer. If it doesn't cover the way that I want to, usually it's just a little inner corner that I usually do when it comes to that. I'm gonna go ahead and throw my lashes on because the glue, the glue has dried until it was tacky. This is how you can tell, excuse the gunk, but um, the ends are more so a clear color, so that means they're like ready to go on. I'm not a good influencer that can just slap it on like most people. I need these tweezers. Moving on to contour, the lashes really took a lot out of me. So, moving on to contour, y'all. <laughs> and then powder, I'll be using um, the e.l.f. 16 Hour Camo Concealer in Deep Cinnamon for my um, contour. I'm gonna do a cream contour. I'm gonna also use the Selfie Ready. I'm gonna also use the Selfie Ready um, setting powder in the translucent and maybe a little bit of the Ofra after I bronze with the Real Her Ultimate Gold Glitter Trio. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm gonna fast forward this since I already let you guys know. So yeah. Oh, and um, also I'm gonna do under here with the brown. You'll see. Oh, I forgot to let you guys know I'm doing the Man Eater, the Tarte Man Eater Mascara. Feels so good. 
I'm gonna wait a little bit. Too bad I don't have a cute little fan like everybody else has. You know, those fans are just litty, you know? And say that I do love the inner corner. The colors are vibrant, pretty, perfect for it today. I love the way the look came out. I'm gonna, while I'm waiting for that, coat my bottom lashes with the Tarte Man Eater. I'm all over the place, you guys. Today, I'm just like, my whole routine is like all the way off. into the goddess of the real her and that's this color and I'm going to hit the high cheek parts right here and around here see that that little bit of glow tutorial if you did a freaky a freaky a